Kenya, a new frontier in the digital revolution. All across the country, the majority of people live in rural areas, far beyond the reach of even the most modest type of modern technology. The gulf in facilities between research hospitals in central Nairobi and the handful of clinics in the rest of the country is vast. But according to the ITU, it need not be unbridgeable. We know that we will never have enough uh, health practitioners to access all the people who need it. And therefore, having access through technology and e-health will enable tremendous opportunities. In rural Kenya, telemedicine allows less experienced doctors to liaise with specialist consultants many hundreds of miles away. Making a real difference to what these clinics can offer doesn't require large amounts of money. Just one computer, a scanner and a digital camera can transform a hospital. They are very far from Nairobi and they don't know what, what type of fracture or what to do with a fracture. So after the X-ray, they scan it, they send it to us, we consult, we give them an answer on what they should do. Either to fix it locally and how to fix it or to refer. ITU is keen not to impose technology on a country, but instead listen to individual needs and tailor solutions accordingly. Here, the biggest need is broadband, which would allow doctors to diagnose patients hundreds of miles away using video conferencing. The ITU standard H264 allows this to happen and has recently earned the ITU an Emmy Award. The scheme can work more effectively if we have got in, uh, connectivity in terms of fiber optic cables within the region. And I think we have only one hospital in Kenya, Nairobi Hospital, which has got fiber optic connection, where you can see everything, even in theatre, in laboratory, as you watch the screen. ITU believe just like transport, energy and water, broadband is a vital part of national infrastructure and have launched the Build on Broadband initiative to bring benefits right across society to deliver essential services such as e-health, e-education and e-commerce. This is why broadband has become so important. We need to ensure that connectivity is uh, giving people the right opportunity to access information, create information, use information and share information to meet the Millennium Development Goals.